y'all didn't know, we actually have three Christmases in Boston. We have the regular Christmas, we have Austin Christmas, and today is like budget Christmas, right? <laughs> budget Christmas is when Boston Mayor Michelle Wu and her administration present the proposed budget for the upcoming fiscal year to the city council, as well as taxpayers. This is a budget that is about people. The proposal calls for a capital plan of $4.2 billion for the fiscal years 2024 through 2028 and an operating budget of $4.28 billion that funds all city services in fiscal year 2024. Some of that money will create new initiatives or expand programs in Boston public schools, like additional universal pre-K for kids ages 3 and 4. $4 million to be able to add 350 UPK seats with Kristen McSwain's leadership. Um, I'm very excited, our team's excited, because we know the difference that that will make to our children and our families. The mayor's budget also includes money to expand social services within the Boston Police Department. Today we're, we're putting forth, a, under the leadership of the mayor, a um, $582,000 uh, set aside for the purposes of increasing our social workers uh, in district stations to help young people uh, with Youth Connect. This morning at the budget breakfast, the mayor announced that Boston has received a AAA bond rating from Moody's and S&P Global for the ninth year in a row. She calls her budget fiscally responsible, but ultimately it'll be up to the city council to decide what the city can afford. Now we go into um, probably 30 some hearings about how these dollars will result in impact for the community. Reporting at City Hall, Todd Keskevich, WCVB News Center 5.